great to teach A level of history to such a diverse, exciting, uh, and intelligent group of, of sick formers. Previous students have always said that the relationship they have with Mr. Donnelly and myself is a positive one in the sense that we're relatively young, we're recently out of university. I suppose all the all the parts of the course, whether it's the Stuart Britain or it's the American Dream or it's the Modern China uh, NEA part, they've all been yeah, they've all been incredible. I think the difference between the A-level course and the GCSE course is that you suddenly have so much more depth and so much more time to explore the periods of history rather than at GCSE you can feel like you're rushing through it. But at A-level you you really sort of immerse yourself in that part of the course that you're studying. Oh, yeah, I do this is really relevant actually. I do have a plan. I'm studying history at university. Um, it's always been my favourite subject and I think definitely A level furthered that and it really cemented history as the course that I wanted to do at university. Uh, it's a great course. Some of the most exciting elements are the Vietnam War. And then we do a lesson where we just sit and have um, an hour where we listen to Vietnam War music and we, we analyse it and what does it mean. And the tutors are very interesting, don't get me wrong. However, I think it's much more unusual to focus on the stewards. And the stewards feel so much more relevant at the moment because we're looking at you know leaving the EU, um, the kind of tensions in Parliament that were going on there.